Welcome back folks to another edition of Let's Play Descent Free Space Oh, Conflict Free Space Oh, Conflict Free Space, The Great War I'm just going to stop saying the name of the game after the next video Just con keeps confusing me So, a uh, couple of uh, r rather easy and successful missions later We find ourselves uh, in a bit of a situation here The intelligence has been analyzing data from the Tombow station attack, from which we saved the survivors, um, where Shivens deployed the Lucifer for the first time. And, uh, yeah, it appears they were tracking that cruiser we helped capture when it reached the station. Intelligence doesn't know how the Shivens tracked the Tyrannus escort, but they've got a team of engineers trying to figure it out. They're also analyzing the shield system on the Lucifer. Unlike the shields on the Shivan fighters and bombers, the shield appears impervious, not merely resistant, to all of our weapons. With the loss of Tomba Station, the Shivans have gained control of the Ribo subspace node. That leaves only two subspace jumps between the Lucifer fleet and the Vasudan homeworld. We must defend the Vasuda Prime. Not only is it the humane thing to do, but it's in our own interest. The Shivans gain control of that system, it will be a short walk to Earth itself. Yeah, never a good idea to allow your allies' home While worlds to get burned. While their proximity to Earth is not for concern, we have no reason to believe the Shivans know the location of our home world. There are dozens of star systems off the Ribos node, and the Shivans will likely have to examine them all. It is obvious, however, that they are narrowing it down, and we can't afford to give up one more inch. Yep. The Lucifer-class destroyer was last sighted in the Ribo system, leading us to believe that Antares is the focal point for the next Shivan offensive. We're going to move the Galatea and its fleet to the Beta Aquilae system, in case the Shivans decide to attack Vasuda Prime through there. Command is sending another Orion-class destroyer, the GTD Bastion, to the Antares system to help us with the blockade. But for the time being, we're the only defense. Right. I am pleased to announce we have two new weapons to use against the Shivans. Hercules heavy assault Hercules, Hercules. The yes. We may study these in the tech room. They will prove very useful. Uh, I'm not a big of, uh, so such big a fan of uh, the synoptic cluster bomb, uh, but the Herc. Report in 20 Yummy. Minutes your mission briefing. I mean, uh, it has its uses, the cluster bomb. Uh, the Merving warhead. Uh, it, it, it's, it can be useful, especially against a uh, large number of uh, lightly shielded and armored targets, or in to like shot into a bigger ship to cause light damage, and then the warheads that break off uh, homing on the small fighters escorting it, but. I still don't like it. Uh, it's slow, and uh, it seems too random uh, in how effective it is. It can be really effective, but usually it's just meh. <laughs> I'd, I'd much rather do deal uh, smaller damage reliably and constant consistently than like e even smaller to amazing damage with this one. Let's check the proof. In order to protect Vasuda Prime, the GTD Galatea will be moving from Antares to Beta Aquilae. Alpha and Beta Wings will provide escort. The sentry guns surrounding the jump node were severely damaged in the recent Hammer of Light attack. Alpha Wing will inspect the sentry guns to determine if they are salvageable. Beta Wing will provide cover. The Galatea will jump into Antares, reset its coordinates, then jump to Beta Aquilae. Lately, the Hammer of Light has been attacking all ships passing through the jump node. It is your responsibility to destroy all enemy ships that you encounter. After the Galatea jumps to Beta Aquilae, you will be contacted by the... We are not being told everything system. here. There, you will receive your briefing and move on to your next mission. Intelligence has specifically requested you and your wing for these missions. Good luck, pilot. Please review your objectives for this mission. Inspect the sentry guns. Yeah, no, that doesn't sound like something that uh, we'd uh, be ordered to do prior to 
this tough mission and uh, yeah I I'm, I'm smelling a rat here I'm smelling that we are kind of a bait on a trap that the Galate is going to ex spring itself on when once the a HOL or the Shivans get here or something I don't know I could be just paranoid but oh yeah gun mount 6 this is the reason why I love the Herc uh doesn't support that many missiles. It's uh, it's decent with its two banks, and they can be filled with qu uh, quite a number of warheads. But the six gun mounts, are ooh, look at them! One, two, three, four, five, six. That's just pretty. Unfortunately, we don't have any more advanced weaponry just yet. I believe we should be getting a few soonish. Not right now. Six uh, Avenger cannons. Yeah, that deals a hell of a punch. As well as some Fury missiles. So this is this is a beast dealing damage to fighters. Uh, it's not really fast. It's uh, reasonably agile. But the speed is an issue. Uh, you're basically, constantly going at, at, at your afterburners just to keep up with the enemy crafts. But that's okay. I I can deal with lack of speed. I can't deal with lack of damage. I uh, I want to be a glass cannon rather rather often. Though this one is not glass cannon at all. This is basically a freaking tank. So good armor, good shields. S slightly crappy speed and insane amount of guns. Love it. Let's go for a test drive. Immediately go for the inspection of the Not guns. Much here, Alpha Wing. All clear here, Beta. I'm going full throttle on this one because I'm guessing these are sabotaged or something and will blow up before oh. Someone's reprogrammed the sentries. I was wrong it's a trap we've been set up Heads up no shit Sherlock so much for a quiet patrol go away oh it's HOL right so we're springing this trap on the hammer of light. I can deal with that. Impressive pilot. Concentrating a bit here. Did they jump away? Really? That's kind of crappy. More than kind of crappy, that's really, really meh. Alpha to Galate, area is clear. You are clear Destroy to jump Ares in. and destroy Gemini, and both of them got away. Hmm. That's sad. Would have li loved to show you a bit more of this Herc in action. There she is. Beautiful Galate. Hammer attack squad jumping in. Protect the Galate. Okay, there they come. And just look at that. Six guns hammering away on a bomber. Doesn't chance stand a chance. Yeah, it might get a few bombs off, but really nothing to be concerned about. Though those plus the bombs the enemy is using, kind of 
irritate me. Not that they would have, would have done all that much damage, it's more like... ...really freaking annoying, that constant beeping from uh, missiles incoming warning. Whoa! There you are. Nighty night. And now we go after the fighters for a bit. Enemy wing has just arrived. Oh, kill stealer. Taurus and Cancer are trying to ram the Galate. Oh no, you don't. Pilots, destroy those kamikaze fighters. They're loaded with warheads. Yep. This Kamikaze guy has got second thoughts about all ramming into the Galate thing. That one didn't. Impressive, pilot. Ooh, surprisingly large amount of beating the Galate has taken. Hello! I don't know if we actually managed to blow that up before it hit the Galate, but I'm really hoping we did. Galate jumping to mid Fourteen percent damage. One, stand by. Your new orders are coming through now. Okay. Pilots, stand by for further orders. Are we continuing straight away? We have reason to believe that the Shivan destroyer EVA is in the Antares system near the Antares Vega jump node. You will jump to this subspace node and investigate. Destroy all hostiles. Further orders will be given to you in mission. Delta Wing will be flying Medusa bombers and will assist you. If you need further assistance, you may call in Epsilon Wing. Galactic Terran Intelligence out. Alright. This is an interesting twist, so we'll have uh, another mission straight after the first one. But I'm going to cut this off here, and uh, yeah, join me again next time for the continuation of this mission. See you later. Bye for now.